Tragic discovery inside a Long Beach apartment complex. Three bodies found, and authorities believe those victims may have been overcome by silent and deadly fumes. The three bodies were inside an apartment in the 1100 block of Gardenia Avenue in Long Beach. CBS 2's Jasmine Beal is live where they're investigating possible carbon monoxide. Jasmine. That's right, Sharon. A woman and two men were found dead inside of their apartment here just 10 days after they had moved in. And like you mentioned, the Long Beach Police Department is trying to determine if they were killed by carbon monoxide poisoning. And as I say that, firefighters are actually going door to door right now, making sure neighbors are safe. And I just spoke to the apartment manager who told me that she believes there were no carbon monoxide detectors inside. I just saw like um, all the cops blocking the the with the street here and neighbors saw the emergency vehicles last night and didn't think anything of it until learning what might have killed three of their neighbors carbon monoxide that's really scary that's really scary long beach police were called out to this apartment complex for a welfare check after noticing the tenants cars had not moved for days and a foul odor was filling the alley we stayed like with the smell for days days that's when the bodies of a woman in her 30s a man in his 50s and another man were discovered that's when they seen one laying down in the kitchen the other one on the floor the other one in the in the bed. The LA County Coroner's Office is trying to determine the exact cause of death, but a large portable propane heater was located inside, and police say it appears they were using it for heat, which fire officials say can produce deadly levels of the gas, especially if the area is not ventilated. New Mom Rosa Polito lives next door. We just had that problem a few weeks ago. Our boiler was actually leaking carbon monoxide. And Diosa, the apartment manager, also told me that each of these units has a gas heater inside, and residents now are a little afraid to even turn those heaters on, even though the Long Beach Police Department is saying that the heater the victims were using was not intended for indoor use. In Long Beach, I'm Jasmine Veal, CBS 2 News.